France is set to vote in the first round of its parliamentary elections tomorrow. President Emmanuel Macron's coalition, the Ensemble Camp, is expected to win the most seats in the 577-member lower house. But opinion polls have predicted that it has a tough fight on its hands to retain its majority. Macron's coalition is expected to get between 260 to 300 seats. They need 289 seats for a majority. The biggest challenge to Macron's hold on parliament is expected from the left coalition of parties. Jean-Luc Mélenchon's New Ecological and Social People's Union, or the NUPS coalition, is hoping to get enough seats to block Macron from getting a majority. Mélenchon narrowly missed out on the second round of the French presidential elections. If Macron fails to get past the 289-seat milestone, he may face legislative deadlock with a hostile parliament. He may not even be able to appoint an ally as prime minister. In the French government, the prime minister is second only to the president. The president can appoint the prime minister but not dismiss them. A situation where the president and prime minister are from different parties is called cohabitation. This last happened in France in 1986. Macron will be hoping to avoid that scenario because he will need parliament's help to pass through key legislations such as changes to pensions and tax cuts. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.